Hello guys. Good evening. Again, we're back again. Uh, before I start with the uh, drinks, actually, uh, the drinks that I can make today actually is the Solo Oreo. It's a, it's a rum-based uh, drinks. I got the coconut uh, rum also, and the white rum, and then I got this uh, choco uh, syrup, and then I got some fresh milk, you know, from Magnolia. So that's good. So before we start that, actually, I guess I'm, I'm gonna show you uh, the uh, the jackfruit actually with uh, infused in the white rum, or if you have a uh, vodka at home and then you can infuse with any actually uh, because the vodka is good also uh, it's odorless uh, the white rum actually is not bad because it's uh, it's not the same as the gold rum and then the what is that the, the dark rum actually because uh, that's like with it's not with actually that's, that's with flavored already and this one's just almost like uh, vodka you know uh, but the vodka is like odorless and and that's that's a good thing with infusing uh like fruits you know because you can take the flavor of the fruits well you can we can try the uh the dark rum or the gold rum also you know that that's gonna be good also so there we go this is the uh, first batch that i do actually a long time ago uh, this is the nasberry uh fruits it's it's really good uh and then the other one actually the jack was almost done because it's they're really good really good really good and it's it's natural uh, fruits actually it's not it's not just taking the flavor out but you put in it you know that's the good things so this is the actual uh, jackfruit i just buy this in the market uh, in the morning uh, today it's like almost uh, three dollars you know uh, it's 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 almost like three dollars so it's it's not bad it's really good it's just a uh, how much uh not three dollars like two fifty dollars you know <laughs> because it's just what hundred peso one twenty hundred twenty so that's it's not bad so this is how you do it you have to remove this uh from jackfruits actually all you need is just uh, pure meat of the jackfruit. See it? This is how the jackfruit smells really good also. So, here we go. And this is the white drum. That's what I'm saying. It's like if you have a vodka at home, that's really good. Really good. And if you have like a stock jar, and that's, that's, that would be nice also uh, to infuse any, any fruits. Make sure that you close it properly, you know, don't skip those uh, flavor and the smell, you know. You have to trap all the smell, you know, so that you can get everything. You can get the aroma also. And this is the uh, seeds of the jackfruit, actually. If you boil these uh, seeds, it tastes like a, uh, a nuts, actually. So I used to boil this. Uh, when I was young actually because we have also jackfruit trees. Uh, my mother actually has a jackfruit trees, you know, so that tastes really good. See another uh, seeds. That's gonna be like a month, then that's, you can see the different, you know, and taste really good. Then if we got longer than that, maybe four months or five months or a year, that's gonna be the best. 
you know like aging so that's that's gonna be good now if you want to buy it from the stores you can buy it you cannot you know just call me up and we'll we'll do it for you and we'll see the price how much we can price that's that will be good and I can do it with vodka also a really good vodka maybe maybe will be there or Ciroc or Tito's or the below 42 or the Stoli I don't know so now you have to add the white rum there's already uh, a little white rum down there too That's what I'm saying, it's like if you have a nice jar to stock with, that's really good. But you have to trap the, uh, you have to cover properly, because if not, then you're just wasting your time. And that's it, so I got a little bit. This, I can make my rings. That's gonna be on the side. So this is it. So it looks like pancit, right? See, look at this. And this gonna be good. Takes like if you can infuse also with chili. The chili is good. You know, it's kind of spicy, a little bit spicy. You know. So now let's start with our drinks. Let me get the ice and the glass. So I got really nice frosty glass down here. Over here, uh, this glass, nice and frosty, right? Keep it in the freezer, that's uh, good. Presentation is really nice. So here we go. So first I have to put the choco first because this is gonna be a uh, Oreo Solo drinks. So a jigger of the white rum. And then a jigger of the coconut rum. about three jigger of the fresh milk so, there we go then shake up with the with the choco otherwise it's not gonna be melt give me the bar spoon Smells really good. I can smell it, and this is gonna be really nice. Let me add another another choco. All right. So this is gonna be about a jigger and a half of the uh, choco actually. So now we can put the ice. So about a uh, scoop of ice again. Always scoop of ice, right? And that's it. the foam it's really foamy it's really good that it really good presentation and then the never forget the Oreo 
the wafer roll Oreo actually. It's really all right. And this is your solo Oreo. There we go. Before we end up this session, actually, uh, please again, uh, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel, uh, The Naked Mixology. I got the uh, Facebook page also, and then I got the uh, Instagram account. So please uh, try to share it to everybody, all your friends, you know. And if you want to learn something, you can always try to message me or whatsoever, you know. So just, just let me know. And thank you so much and have a good night, everybody. Thank you. It's good.